you know, first I'd like to apologise to the club and um, the playing group and most supporters for withholding um, truth on what happened Sunday morning. Um, what I can do now is you know, put my best foot forward and I've got four weeks of proof with my teammates to win respect back, especially from the coaches, and um, let's go forward from there. It looks like uh, Jeff might have uh, been knocked out and down on the ground. Can you just tell us uh, how you learned of Jeff's injury and what you did in the aftermath? Did you assist him, for example? Yeah, um, as it happened, I got, in, I got involved to try and um, push the um, attackers away and in, during that I was king hit a couple of times. So um, once once we realised that the, we're in the wrong spot at the wrong time, we decided to all get out of there and um, in knowing that I went straight home and spoke to Jeff the next day. Mitch, how come you didn't come clean with the club straight away? Yeah, I was worried about myself and Jeffrey's um, in, you know, circumstances which probably would happen from it. Um, I wasn't too clear on what happened to Jeff, so um, yeah, it was a, you know, I, I've, I've definitely found out now I was in the, I was in the wrong, and um, all I can do now is apologise to the club and the, my teammates and stuff and go forward. But I've definitely learnt um, coming clean earlier would be a, would have been the best thing for the club. And you're out of contract at the end of the year. Are you concerned this might affect your, your future at the Carlton Footy Club? Yeah, definitely. Um, you know, the club's been fantastic with me for my six years I've been here. Um, we're in negotiations, so we'll, I will, I'll get back to the club next week and we'll talk about that. But as I said, I've got four weeks to try and put my best foot forward and you know, prove to the club why I should be here and um, going forward. Last one. Uh, why did you put yourself in that situation at 5am in the morning? Yeah, it's just realising what time is um, you know, suitable to be out and you know, putting yourself in, the, you know, in situations like that outside of a club where um, you know, people are lingering around kind of drunk and stuff. So you know, I'll learn from that definitely and um, putting, putting things in place where I can, I, can, I can be home at a reasonable hour. Thanks, Thank you, Nick.